I'm here to deliver a message from Luke. Save your breath. I don't know you from Adam, and I won't discuss business with strangers. For I know you could be talking to the Gestapo. No, but I'm sure they'd love to have a chat with me. If you want to deal with us, you'll first have to prove you can be trusted. All right, then. What'll it take to convince your people that Luke and I are on the level? Excuse me, young man. Is that how you address a lady? I don't believe I caught your name. I... Uh, uh, Sean Devlin. Begging your pardon, ma'am. And I am the Lady Margot Bonaire. I've heard of you, Irishman. Tell me, are these stories true? I suppose that depends on who's talking. The Germans are talking, Monsieur Devlin. The local authorities have taken a great interest in your activities. How would you know that? One of my people placed wiretaps on the phones at the local Gestapo headquarters. Must be a clever chap. Indeed. Joseph Breuermann is one of our most valuable agents. Last night he was arrested. I fear he will not hold out long under questioning. He is not a brave man. What if I were to make other arrangements for this man, Bryman? Would that settle your doubts as to me and my friends? Yes, but it won't be easy. Bryman is being held under close watch. You may need to create a distraction, a explosive, perhaps. Aye, or a disguise. Yes. In the right uniform, you could walk yourself right out of the detention. But if the guards suspect an escape, they will kill you both. Don't you worry, ma'am. I'll bring your boy home in one piece.
Oh, fucking deadly! There's our man now. Look out below! Please, I, I am innocent. I, I do not know anything about the resistance. Keep your trap shut, and follow me if you want to live. Les papiers de transit sont obligatoires à tous les points de contrôle. La présentation de papiers non conformes sera sévèrement punie. to get inside and warm up. Du wagst es, einen deutschen Soldaten anzusprochen? Lovely piece, this one. So what's a German like you doing working against his own side? They are not my side. And the Nazis, the blood running through my veins is a death sentence. How did you get into this game? I was studied as a radio engineer at Heidelberg. My family fled, and the Nazis seized power. 
I ended up here. And so you joined the French resistance? It seems the only sensible thing to do. Sensible? <laughs> That's rich. We are men without countries, you and I. But not men without souls, yeah, Irishman? If you say so. Who are they? Friends. Renard and his men. They disappeared two days ago. This morning we found them here. What happened? They were preparing for a mission. Renard was caught with a pocket full of detonators. He was a hard man. But he broke under torture and gave the others up. That clone butcher skinned him like an animal. What did you say? The Nazis knew chief of public security, an SS colonel. Before the war he was some kind of race car driver. Jerker. Yes, that's him. This is his message to the Resistance. What was Renard's target? The siege gun at the Lycée Theater. It's a symbol of Nazi power in this part of the city. The sound it makes is deafening. Every time it fires, the people of Paris lose hope. Then we'll give him something to cheer about. I thought you might feel that way. Speak to Bryman.
It's so good to see you, my friend. Likewise. What's the score? The Nazis have located one of our safe houses in the countryside. A place where we hide the women and children from the Gestapo. They are dialing the house's coordinates into the siege gun. Can you warn them? Nine. There isn't time. Then we'll have to do the job quick. Take these. You're going to need a powerful explosive charge to destroy the gun. Achtung! Achtung! Einsatzbereitschaftsprotokoll ist aktiviert. Zehn Minuten bis zum Abschuss. Beginn Flugbahn zur Störung. That's better. Er ist hier. Ich rieche ihn. Gut, Gütiger. Neun Minuten bis zum Abschuss. I need to slot that technician before he pulls the trigger. It's not supposed to stay on the inside. myself a little time.
A man by the name of Horst is organizing an underground street race in the city. I thought you might be interested. Skylar. Ihre Reisepapiere? Sofort stehen bleiben! Ihre Papiere! Gut! On my way then! Where's Skylar? Miss Sinclair is away on business. She sends her warmest regards. Right then. I don't like you, and I trust you even less. I'm only here because of what you said about Jules. If this is one of your tricks, we're about to find out just how blue that blood of yours is. I must confess I find your candor most refreshing, Mr. Devlin. In my line of work, honesty is the rarest of vices. Secrets are the currency of my profession. Your friend Jules was killed to protect a rather important secret. Did you know that? Dierker thought we were working for you. Perhaps, but Jules had to die in any case. He had seen too much. As did you. The Doppelseek factory. What's really going on up there? Are you familiar with the concept of atomic fission? Uh, I've never been one for poofy cocktails. I'm sure the barman will be relieved. But it's beside the point. Your friend Jules was killed to protect the secrecy of certain enemy plans. Plans which are critical to the German war effort. I intend to shatter those plans and to destroy the men behind them. How about it, Mr. Devlin? Up for another game? Aye. What'll it be this time? Miss Sinclair will return shortly to brief you on the next phase of the operation. If you can pull this one off, they'll give you the Victoria Cross. Ooh. Is that some sort of medal? The VC is my government's highest honor. Then I'll know what to wipe me arse with. Let's call it a case of scotch. Now you're talking. Cheers.
Reisepapiere herzeigen. Die Papiere scheinen in Ordnung zu sein. Danke. Guten Tag, Jens. We should have booked a hotel room. <sighs> Naughty boy. I don't typically mix business and pleasure, but sometimes I can't help myself. For a moment there, I thought you were dead. Not quite. But the bastards get an A for effort. If this isn't a social call, what are we talking about? You're going to help us take a man from a train, then drive the train over a cliff. Sounds like fun. Ever blown up a bridge? Not yet. But I'm a fast learner. Who's the punter? Dr. Klaus Kessler, chief engineer for the Nazi secret atomic weapons program, codenamed Volhom. The secret that got Jules killed. You were practically on top of Kessler's lab when you were captured. Bloody bad luck. Poor Jules. Bad luck for the fucking crowds. So what exactly is this? Kidnapping? Defection. Dr. Kessler wants to see. Peter, Kessler, the the Ausgangssperre heute 15 Minuten später in Kraft. Den Pass und die Reisepapiere. Sofort stehen bleiben. Ihre Papier. Now where were we? Dr. Kessler wants to switch sides. The Nazis will kill him before they let that happen. So you want the crowds to think he's already dead? Spot on. When we destroy the train, the Nazis will assume Kessler has been assassinated. By the time they realize what really happened, Kessler will be in London, working for our side. Downright devious. That's Bishop's style. Our first order of business is to wire the bridge with demolition charges. I'll leave the heavy lifting to you. Don't tell me you don't like to get dirty. You know better than that. I just like to see you work up a sweat. Charges under the bridge where the structure looks weak. And to trigger them? The last charge goes on the tracks. It'll set off the rest when the train hits it. Bleeding diabolical. I'll be right back. Down, a million to go. Some of these struts have seen better days. How about? Here. Here we are.
Son of a bitch! One more on the tracks now. That's that.